True Cards, how to survive your first game of rugby. Sick of watching rugby from the sidelines? Always wanted to give it a go but too scared to be shown up? Well, here are some basic tips for all those out there who have never played a game of footy. All right, you've just run onto the rugby field for the first time in your life. Rugby is considered to be one of the most brutal sports in the world, so it's understandable if you're nervous. But you can't let the opposition know. Our first tip, be courageous. If the enemy sends you're scared, the entire team will run your way. So put that angry J kick your face on and get pumped. Okay, the bro next to you is about to pass you the ball for the first time and defenders are rushing right towards you. Never take your eyes off the ball. Yes, Ma'anonu may be running right at you with a menacing shoulder, but you need to block all that out and focus on the ball. And while we're at it, catch the ball with two hands, it's just safer. Don't try and be like Carlos Spencer and catch it with one hand because you can't. Give your bro a target, put both hands up in front of your chest and voila, you just received the ball like a champ. Now you've just got the ball and you can see the enemy in front of you. Sidestep time. Imagine defenders are all trees. Their body represents a tree trunk while their arms are the branches. Do a snazzy little sidestep just before you get to them so you don't run fully into the trunk. Go on YouTube to study the legends of sidestep. Search for people like Roger Tuivasa Sheik, Rua Tipuki and Benji Marshall. Kicking. If this is your first game, leave it to your teammates. One thing you're gonna have to do though is tackle. Having a player run through you is one of the most shame things that can happen on the field. So our tackle tip is, aim low. If you wrap their legs up, they will go down. But if you aim high, you might find yourself flying backwards like many of Jonah Lumu's would-be tacklers. And lastly, catching. At some point, a kick is going to come your way. The best thing you can do is soar into the sky like Israel Dag does when catching. That way you can safely catch the ball as defenders aren't allowed to tackle you while you're in the air. Sweet, now all you've got to do is tie those boots up, put that mouth guard in and get out there, because you're about to play the greatest game in the world.